Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Jeff Sherry. I'm the museum educator at the Hagen History Center. And we're going to be presenting a series of videos on military uniforms as well as some other things. And I've enlisted the help of my son, who's going to come and be our model today. Corporal. The corporal is wearing the standard uniform in the field of a Union corporal. The start from the top, his 1858 model 4-inch cap, which with the leather visor you can see provides very little protection from the elements. His four-button fatigue blouse, or sack coat as it was called, over a civilian shirt. The Army issue shirts and underwear were made out of something called domit flannel and it was extremely uncomfortable. The four-button sack coat is probably the most common coat worn by Union soldiers during the Civil War. The chevrons are that of a corporal, and they're in sky blue, which designates his branch. He is in the infantry, a foot soldier. His trousers, typical army sky blue wool as well, kersey, very heavy, and his shoes are all leather booties, which is short for short boot, or brogans as they're sometimes called. They have an iron heel plate on the heel that prevents wear of the shoe. It wasn't meant for any traction. Now he's carrying one of the deadliest weapons in American history, the 1861, excuse me, Springfield rifled musket. He can fire three aimed rounds a minute, but it is a muzzle loader, which is really slow by today's standards. He also has in, right there by his belt plate, his bayonet. His triangular bayonet can be affixed to the end of the musket and it can be used for charging enemy positions. And while the bayonet was used in some Civil War battlefields, its psychological effect was more prevalent than anything. On his left hip, he has his painted canvas haversack and his tin cup. In that cup, which you can see is all blackened, he can boil his coffee, heat up his rations, whatever he might do. Just above the haversack is his wool-covered one-quart tin canteen. Now on the back of the soldier, he wears a canvas soft pack, his knapsack, with his wool blanket attached on top. In his knapsack, the soldier carries everything that he thinks he will need on campaign. Early soldiers would carry everything the army issued, and these of course ended up by the side of the road very quickly. This soldier is a veteran, so he only has a few pairs of socks, a towel, an extra shirt, maybe a spare pair of underwear in there. His cartridge box, as you can see on his uh, other hip, is all leather and contains his uh, 60 rounds of ammunition, 40 in the cartridge box and probably 20 more in his pocket. Well, that more or less concludes our talk about our Civil War infantrymen today. Thank you for joining us and keep your eye posted for more videos like this.